Hey guys, I'm Paul the Mortar Guy. Now in this video, I'm going to show you just how your front wheel placement is affected depending on your fairing. I will compare the fairings on my 2011 Kawasaki Concourse, a 2009 Harley Street Glide, and a 2017 Harley Road Glide. So hang tight. For the demonstration, I will use three cones that are seven inches tall. Now we're going to ride all three bikes towards the cones at a nice controlled speed. And we'll come to a nice smooth stop when the cone disappears from our view. As you can see, each bike stopped at a different distance from the cone. The road glide stopped at 12 and a half inches from the cone. The street glide stopped at eight and a half inches from the cone and my concourse stopped at six and a half inches from the cone. So as you can see, depending on what type of fairing you have, your perception on your front wheel placement could be different. Now I couldn't find a Harley Road King for this demo, but I did ride Robert Simmons 2019 Road King Special when I rode in his practice session number 41. Now, because of the clear windshield on the Road King, it was much easier for me to dial in my front wheel placement because the cone never disappeared from my view. What I have found is that most riders that have windshield and fairings will stop when the cone disappears from their view. But now because of their windshield and their fairings, they think they're at the cone, but the front tire is actually short of the cone. Now the height of the cone or the object will also affect your front wheel placement. Now the smaller the cone or object, the further away you will stop from the cone. Now this is very important information if you want to dial in your front wheel placement. Now I think that being able to put your front tire where you want it should be the goal of every rider because this will help you with your overall motorcycle placement, no matter if you're doing cone work or you're out there on the roadway. The drill I came up with to help you with this is what I call the front tire placement drill. Now this drill will help you learn how to put your front tire in places with precision. Now I recommend you watching this video where I go over how to do the front wheel placement exercise. Now until next time, Practice, 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 and ride safe.